spending the rest of my life with the same one, same one. Ain't no I ain't team. I'ma bring you good love, just come with me. Baby, you're all the company. Hey guys, what's up? I am your favorite girl, A. Marie. Today we have a drugstore haul. I'm gonna give you guys a haul. It's a mixture of all girly things, okay? But before we jump off into it, I would love for you guys to hit the subscribe button as well as the notification. Give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down. It doesn't matter. Either way it go, I'm still gonna post. Share with your friends just so YouTube algorithm could pick me up and start to people, you know what I'm saying? Start spitting me out to people. If you would like to see this look, I will have it linked up here in the cards. Let's jump right on in, grab you a snack, get you a cold drink, and let go. All right, so before we start, I do want to start off by I bought a book. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. I bought a book and the book is called In Search of Freedom, My Journey Through Unresolved Trauma by Ramesha Nicole. So you guys, for one, Ramesha Nicole is my god sister and she just became an authorist and she wrote her first book. So if you guys are interested in a good read, the divorce in the moment it happened, saved and depressed. I mean, there's different chapters in here and it's just a search of freedom. And she's real big on financial freedom, cleaning up your debt. And she's a God fearing woman, like so seriously, she's a God fearing woman. So I will have her book linked down below if you guys would like a good read if you guys would like to support me go ahead and head over to amblavish.com use the coupon code that's down below in the description and shop it up i have body butters body scrubs um lashes lip glosses liquid lipsticks lip liners highlighters i have almost everything girly and right now in real time Everything is on sale right now because I am trying to sell out of everything that I got so I can bring a brand new upgraded shipment in and bust it out for you guys. If you guys would like to support, go ahead over there and get it while it's on sale. Plus, you can use the discount code that's down below in the description. We have a Walmart bag. Quite a lot. I got another bag that's down below. So, like I said, everything is basically new to me but probably not so much new anymore in the drugstore but i'm still going to use it i'm still going to bring it to camera i'm still going to show you guys because it is still new to me in my collection so the first thing i got is the elf complexion essentials brushes and sponge i haven't purchased elf brushes in a minute so i was like you know what i might as well just try this we do have the F sponge and all of the brushes, which, all right, it does have the names, you guys. When I say I haven't even looked at everything. So this one here is a highlighting brush. This one is a angled blush brush. And then this one is a powder, powder blurring brush, as well as the flawless concealer brush. So this should be good for a full, not a full face, but you know, a complexion type of face, uh, type of use. I can't wait to use it. I know I'm gonna use it in a video. So I did go ham on some press-ons. I went ham. I'm getting into these press-ons and the colors and the feels and the different shapes. And I think it'll be easier for me considering that I do hair a lot. I don't do like sew-ins and stuff like that, but I do do a lot of braiding styles. I have two boys, I have goddaughters, I have nieces, I have nephews. Everybody likes to get their hair braided. So, and I got a wife, she gets her hair braided too. And she gets her hair braided, but not so often, but when she do want to braid it, like, I gotta be available, you know what I'm saying? Because nobody else gets in her hair. I, I don't do that. So the press-ons I thought would be good for me 
since I do a lot of hair. Um, so I did pick up the Salon Perfect. This is Modern French Tip and they're the neon set. I think they're super freaking cute. I did get the extra long length and these are Kiss Gel Fantasy Collection. And it just says sculpted nails. It doesn't have like a name style, but these blues are gorgeous. I also picked up the long length Kiss Vogue Fantasy. And this is the tie dyed nails and they are gorgeous as well. And then I got the other set and this one is the modern French tip neon color. This one is, this one says cool pink too, but Ivy is not cool pink. It's a neon yellow. All right, so I did pick up these polishes. Did I only pick up two? So LA Girl came, LA Colors came out with a some new gel polishes. So this is the Color Last Nail Polish, and it says it lasts up to 10 days with color lash top coat here are the two colors i got the neon pink and the nude the nude color is linger super cute and nude could go for any season and then the pink is family ties i started going back to the nail shop just recently i only been once but Recently, I started going back and you guys, I finally got my toes done for the first time in like a year or two and it was so lovely. Okay, it was so lovely. So I'll do my hands at home. I got poly gel sets. I got dip powder. I have all that stuff. If you guys been rocking with me for a while, you guys have kind of noticed that I've been getting into nails lately. So that's what we're going to do. Okay, so be ready for the video. So, I did kind of go ham on foundations, and that is just in this bag. So, let's start off with, I had to pick me up another NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop. Um, my last one, y'all, the top, the pump won't work, so I had to break the top off. And then when I used it, I felt like it was a little too dark for me. This is the old one. It's in the shade Mocha. And I did pick up a new one and I got cappuccino. Got cappuccino just so that I could, you know, see if I really still like it because mocha is too dark. And plus I couldn't use the pump. So I needed to pick up another one. Um, I hauled a long time ago. I'll link that haul in here. I did get a lot of this, um, what is this called? TLB. But I bought a lot of their products. And when I bought the products, they didn't have um, a foundation in my shade at the time. So TLB Vegan Beauty Face Just Tint 3 and 1 Tinted Skin Conditioner. And I did get the shade Chocolate Chip. Okay, so you guys, I am going to go back to Foundation Fridays here on my channel. And sometimes it will be just straight foundation and a wear test. Sometimes it will be foundation with a whole full face and my thoughts down below or my thoughts as a voiceover and stuff like that. I want to kind of switch it up. I do want to bring Foundation Fridays back, but I do want to kind of switch it up and kind of let you guys, you know, see it in different ways. Not just me putting on a foundation, wearing it all day and giving y'all my updates or how I feel about it, stuff like that. Some days I want to do a full face and on those Fridays it will be a brand new foundation that I have yet to open. It may not be the newest foundation on the block, but it's a foundation that I have yet to open. So all of these foundations will go into the new pile and I will schedule out like how I want to do it. You know what I'm saying? Speaking of more foundations. I did get the Maybelline Superstay Active Wear and I got the shade 360 Mocha and 340 Cappuccino. Mocha may look right on point, but I'm normally a Cappuccino in Maybelline, but this Cappuccino looks a little bit too light. So we will see when Foundation Friday comes. And I'm not that active, like as in workouts and stuff, but I do have two children that are very active in sports, school, 
and all that and I be on the go I do run my business I do go to the grocery store and all that you know so active wear I said hey why not I still be active you know what I'm saying like so I think it'll work for me oh so, L'Oreal true match this is the nude foundation this is a hyaluronic tinted serum they call it a serum but it's a foundation it says it's one percent pure hyaluronic and I got the shade 10.5 to 11 rich deep which rich deep has never been in my category for foundations but we will try it you guys let me know which foundation you want me to review first on the first um foundation friday we have the nyx can't stop won't stop we have the tlb uh lip bar that's the name of this the lip bar foundation we have the l'oreal we have the maybelline active and then we have one more i got the new lord uh, laura mercier flawless luminaire radiant perfecting foundation and i got the shade 5w1 amber so i only got this because platinum d here on youtube i will link her channel up here and down below in the description whichever way i can without running out of space you guys she was doing a giveaway she gets pr from laura mercier and they gave her a free coupon for her viewers her subscribers her plat brats which we are plat brats um and i told her i wanted it i you know entered myself into the little giveaway and she reached out to me and she gave it to me so i don't know if amber five w1 is gonna be my shade laura mercier did have a return receipt if you would like to exchange it send it back or whatever the case may be and i just never did because i was too busy doing other things and i wasn't wearing makeup so i wasn't even worried about it so we're still gonna test it out i never had a laura mercier um foundation before thank you platinum d for gifting this to me i really 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 truly appreciate it i love you you are still in my heart in my prayers and in my thoughts but i never tried laura mercier um foundations i don't think so i can't wait because i haven't shopped high end in a long, long time the only way i shop high end is if it comes in a box of charm so we will test it out and see. Um, I did pick up, oh you guys, this was an oldie but a goodie, but I did get some new shades. I got the Maybelline Age Rewind concealers. I got 144 Caramel. And then I got 142 Golden Dior. Y'all, I haven't used these in so long and I was like, you know what? I need to go back and try them i remember back in the day i used to be obsessed with these and they tingled kind of burned your under eye a little bit but nonetheless girl i was in love with these all maybelline concealers so i did pick up the cover girl wait i got another cover girl product this is the cover girl clean fresh hydrating concealer and i got two shades the clean um line of cover girl i heard one wasn't so good i think like the foundation people had bad reviews about but i was like let me just try it i won't try the foundation but i'll try the concealer because it's more on the lighter side when it comes to the foundations and you know your girl kind of like a medium to full coverage not a light coverage you know so i got 14 rich deep y'all excuse Prada. he wants to go in the house and then I got 400 Rich. So be on the lookout for those because they will be in like a get ready with me new drugstore makeup type of videos. I also pick up, picked up the CoverGirl Outlast Extreme Wear Press Powder. And this is the full coverage press powder for up to 16 hour wear. And the shade is... 875 soft sable now soft sable normally pulls cool on me but this one looked kind of rich so i was like you know what let's try it most of all of these products 
will be in like first impressions, uh, makeup tutorial with new drugstore type of videos. So if you guys are into that and you want to see how these makeup products turn out, my thoughts, my feelings on them, click the subscribe button as well as turn your post notifications to all. Turn it on. Set it to all so you don't miss that video. The last products I got in this bag is going to be some NYX lip products. So I did finally, finally find the NYX Butter Gloss Cinnamon Roll Lip Gloss. You guys, do y'all remember when Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, I mean, everybody was talking about Cinnamon Roll? Oh my God, every time somebody talked about Cinnamon Roll, I went to a store trying to find it and could never. Okay, so I finally looked up on it and now that I've got it, of course the hype is over, but I still want to see and get that feeling everybody else got when they wore it. So I needed it. The last two products are lip products and these are some new lip products from NYX. This is the NYX Lingerie XXL Lips. I want to say they're liquid lipsticks. Um, this shade is Flaunted Pinky Nude. And I did go for the nudes, you guys, because I just didn't know. Yeah, they're the MAC liquid lipsticks. Um, what is this one called? Turn On. Okay, so first of all, I love the doe foot. It's not all the way open. It has just a dip. You see that? It's not a hole in there it's at an angle but you see that bump on it and it collects all inside that bump here is turn on Ooh, yes it's a pinky nude and here is flaunted right there girl why there you go boom so this bag is kind of full as well it's a mixture of walmart and family dollar um, at the Family Dollar, I did get a LED um, Colorways, yeah, Colorways Diffuser. It's a desk diffuser. You guys, I told y'all I went missing. Y'all seen I went missing. I been in a funk. So I was like, if I get some diffuser, get me a diffuser and put some eucalyptus in it. You know, every time, every morning I get up. Every night I go to sleep, house, room smells good, lights is going, I'm calm, I'm, you know, it may put me in a better mood. Um, I did get a hair dye, you guys. I got the Got To Be Dark Ruby Metallics hair dye. I am grown and one day I was just sitting back thinking like, you know what, I've never, ever in my life dyed my hair, like, one solid color, I never dyed my hair. When I was like maybe 14, 15, my mom allowed me to get highlights, but the highlights was so non-highlightish that you really couldn't even tell. But I could tell because I know I went to the hair salon and got it done. You guys, I've never dyed my hair. I've always wore colored hair. So I was like, you know what? Let's try it. Let's try it. And we'll see how it come out. We'll see. Um, at the Family Dollar, they also had this Modessa nail dryer, and it's a cordless one, and you just place your hand on it and it dries. Um, this is also for my nail polish and stuff like that. Self-explanatory. I did pick up me another fingernail file. This is the manicure system, um, and it's by Modessa 2. It comes with the buffing tool, the emery, the shaping the fine shaping, the cuticle pusher, and a storage bag. It's a seven piece set. And I decided to start, well, my mom gave me one and then I picked up this one. It's almost the exact same ones, but I'm not into the nail shop drills yet. I'm nowhere on that level. So I was like, you know what? Let's pick up another one so that when we're doing our nails, we can have it working around the last four items i got is some more press on nails i told you guys it's it's crazy over here 
So I did get the long coffin shape LA Colors <clears throat> Lavish Nails. It's the 26 piece and it's called Wild Rush. You guys, these are freaking amazing. Then I got the extra long length um, Kiss Jewel High Fashion Glamour Nails. This is the Ultra Smooth. And these are, it just says DKJN03RF. It's no name, but these are gorgeous too. Oh, look at the ombre and the bling. All right, then I got the long length um kiss salon colored nails ready to wear this is the full cover nails and this one is dgk 09 rf and they are shorts but they are nudes they are browns they are considered long length but they're shorter and then the last ones i got is the extra long fashion design nails by kiss as well and this is dg dn 21 rf and I love these as well. So that is everything that's in this drugstore haul. Um, it hasn't been many things, but I just still wanted to show you guys and let you guys know what to be looking forward to because it's coming, okay? It's coming. Let me know which foundation I should do in the first Foundation Friday. Which pair is your favorite pair? Get the comments rolling. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click the notification bell. I said give this video a like. Give it a thumbs down if you didn't like it. You know what I'm saying? But still, all in all, share with your friends so YouTube algorithm could kick me out to new people so we can have more diamonds and gems join the family. I love you all, and I will catch y'all in the next one. Trying to spend the rest of my life with you.